crew. Come on through, crew. Come on through. Come on through. La Familia. Come on through. Come on through. I'm gonna find me a nice little shaded area of the park as I talk to my bricks. Find me a nice little shaded area. Hold on, y'all. Find me some quick shade. What up? Come join me, shoot. You riding with me? Cause I find a little shaded area so I can talk side to you for a little bit. Come on through, squad. Family, hold on, I think I done found me a, a nice little shaded area. It's gonna be close, yeah, that'll work. Misty, Lonnie, Kelly, Zaria, what's happening? What's up, gorgeous people? What up, beautiful people? Terrigia up in here, what up, y'all? What's good? I just, um, uh, Finished doing a five mile run. And I was like, shoot, let me holler at my bricks. Angelina in the place. What's up, gorgeous people? Look, Lynn up in here. Now let me talk to y'all. And oh, 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 oh. And, and do this for me too. Let me ask y'all something, cause y'all gonna help me with something. Y'all gonna help me with a couple of things, okay? What should I give? And thank you for the share, Lynn. Hey, Patty. I need, look, I need some help with this. Y'all help me. Hey, Bridget, help me. What should I give the brick of the week this week? Should it should it be a one hour massage or should it be a, a mani patty? Cash your votes, please. Cash your vote. The beautiful Vonda up in here. Hey baby. What what should I give? Should it be a one hour massage? Or a mani patty? For the brick of the week. What should I give away? Because y'all been working now. Misty says a Manny Patty. Okay. Put a check by that. Hey, Steph. Shoot. Bridget says a Manny Patty. Okay. Zari says Manny Patty. Boom. Liz says Patty. Boom. Okay. Well, that's what's up. Look, let me strike the gavel. Look, Stephanie said, wait, we got a, we got a one-hour massage up in here. Stephanie has casted her vote. Now, I'm gonna let y'all continue to vote as I talk. Just finished the five mile run, right? Hey, Devonna. And it just made me realize, okay, my message to you, stay focused. Because you know, this is, this is graduation season. People getting out of school, you know? And, and you gotta keep in mind that everybody else's goals aren't your goals, okay? So they don't care about getting finer. A lot of them don't. A lot of them have just given up. They just, they just gave up. Well, this is what it is. This is all I got to give this summer. But at the end of the day, ain't nobody gonna holler at it. Ain't nobody gonna try to get with it. So if that's all you got to give me, I don't want it. I'm just saying. And there's a lot of people out there who gonna have that same reaction. If this is all you can give me, I don't want it, I'm saying. So with that being said, their goals are not your goals. So I need for you to focus. And I need for you, you can celebrate and you can have a good time, but you gotta reel yourself in whenever you feel like you're starting to drift a little bit. Hey, Kimberly. So whenever you start to feel yourself drift out there and you start acting like everybody else, ask yourself with the people that you hanging out with, do I want to look like that? Because again, your goals are not their goals. Feel me on that. Y'all don't, y'all don't have the same goals. So I'm going to need for you to focus. You know, again, it's okay to have a good time, but when you start doing as everybody else is doing and you ain't trying to look like them, then you have to reel yourself back in and be like, okay, I may have had a moment, but you know what? 
it's time to reel this thing back in because again, I'm trying to lose 20 pounds. I'm trying to lose 40 pounds. I'm trying to lose 60 pounds. And again, they don't care about losing 20 pounds. They don't care about losing 40. Uh, they don't care about, you know, trying to lose 60 to 100. So you got to stay locked in on your agenda. Again, have a good time. But I'm just saying, uh, know when to reel that thing back in. Versus, well, let me go ahead and go all the way. No, don't go all the way. You ain't got to go all the way. You haven't always gone all the way. I'm sure there's some instances in your life where you done kind of went halfway in certain areas of your life, wink, to where you went kind of halfway, and then you were like, nah, this ain't right. I don't need to be doing this. And then you backed away from me. It was like, nah, 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 I'm good. Same theory. <laughs> Look, everything is relative. So if you can step away, and you can go halfway with certain things and decide to disqualify yourself from doing certain things like that. And you have in the past. You can for other things, correct? You Look, you ain't got to go all in if you ain't all in. I'm just saying. So let's look. Stay focused. Stay focused. We're going to do some awesome things together. But I need for you to stay focused. It's going to require it's going to require you to... Uh, you know, lock in and just remember why you're here. If you're on this broadcast, you're here for a reason. If you're working out hard with me, you know, you're, you're there for a reason. If you're trying to take your life to a different level, you know, that's your reason. So be committed to your reason. Okay? So that's what's up. So I'm about to bounce on y'all, but I just had to holler at you. Love each and every single last one of you. Look, we're going to be great together, and we're going to take our lives to a different level. Also, congratulations uh, to the girls who emailed me, because one of the things that I love doing is making sure that you're awesome in all areas of life. And uh, one of my bricks, Brent, so she's a consultant, and you know she helps uh, just grow businesses. So one of the things that I did was, you know, for my bricks who want to be entrepreneurs. I basically gave a free, had them get a free consultation, you know, from her. So congratulations to, to my entrepreneurial bricks who are about to take their money to a different level. Cause I, cause like I always say, I can't have you being fine and being broke. That's just not the, you know, that's just not the Christian way of doing stuff. I can't have y'all fine, but you're lacking. Because again, I believe in having abundance, having abundance in all areas of life. You know, I need for you to be banging in all areas of life. I need for your hater meter to just go up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, because people hate people who doing awesome. Just hate them. Absolutely hate them. So if that's kind of like the, 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 the thing that we measure in terms of success, which is your hater meter, we need to increase your hater your hater rating. We need to up your membership. <laughs> we need to up your membership. So if you got five haters, I need for you to have at least 25. Again, you know, if, if those are the parameters, if if that's the metrics for measuring success is your haters. I need for you to get a whole bunch of haters. You bang it. Body slam it. Your money good too. You happy. You know, there's nothing, anything, anybody can say to you that can bring you down. I need for you to be at that level up there to where you're flying so high you can't hear anything below you. Again, when you see an airplane flying in the air at 30,000 feet, if you're standing on the ground, they can't hear you. You can holler all you want to, shoot up in the air all you want. They're not going to hear you because they're flying so high up in the air. They can't hear you. That's how I need for you to live your life. I, I need for you to be up so high that what other people say about you don't even matter. How about that? So let's go get it. Love y'all. I'm gone.